Hello and welcome to this video demonstration of the new Future Sound Systems POCA. That stands for Passive Optically Controlled Attenuator. There are four of these attenuators in this module. It's uh, 6 HP wide. Each one is based around a Vactrol, uh, which is switchable between a kind of typical VCA mode and a low-pass gate mode. At the moment, you're going to hear the uh, VCA modes. Um, we've got two channels, um, kind of two pairs of attenuators set up together to give a slightly steeper uh, kind of curve to the Vactrol effect, uh, which you'll see in a moment when we start using some trigger signals with it as well. But firstly, I'm going to take a couple of uh, static voltage sources from the Future Sound System's voltage disperser straight into the CV input. So on the first channel we have some noise coming from the Spectral Devastator over on the right and then on the second pair of gates we have uh, Braids doing its thing. And I'll now swap this over to the trigger signal so we can actually hear the Vatrals being pinged. Also note that the CV inputs are normal together, so you can use one control voltage uh, all the way down the gates. And this is true of also the outputs to the inputs, so each Vactrol is effectively uh, normal together in series. Um, we'd suggest only using two uh, Vactrol elements in series though, otherwise uh, the buffer at the end of your signal chain can have uh, loading problems. That gives you a pretty clear indication of how uh, the VCA mode sounds. What I'll do now is flip the module over and change the four gates to low pass gate mode. So I've just swapped all of the four gates of the POCA back into low pass gate mode and uh, we'll pretty much run exactly the same tests again. Uh, note in this case I'm only using one gate per channel uh, because I find in the low pass gate mode you only really need one. Um, the kind of uh, Vactrol coupling is only really that useful if you want steeper curves in VCA mode. So I'm going to feed it some static voltages from the voltage disperser again, just so you can hear the uh, kind of Vactrols being swept, and then ping them with trigger signals uh, once more so you can hear how the Vactrols sound when pinged. So here we're uh, controlling our baseline with the LFO output of the Frequency Central Ultrawave. Um, and I'll just change, uh, we've currently got this in the downwards uh, ramp waveform. I'm just going to change the distortion parameter to shape that a little bit and you can hear how the Vactrol responds to different ramps.
So generally when you're in low pass mode, it's uh, pretty snappy towards uh, LFO shapes, especially when they're um, positive going only. Um, note that the CVs can only take uh, positive CV signals due to the configuration of the Vatrol. Uh, but generally the POCA offers you uh, four gates uh, in a pretty compact package, um, which are easy to use just due to the normaling and the, the, the kind of pre-patching of the CV and outputs to inputs. Uh, we hope you've enjoyed watching this video, and if you'd like any more information, please visit our website at www.futuresoundsystems.co.uk. Thank you very much.